this is everyone's favorite uh, jack of all trades and a master of none, Commodore Urban. Yeah, hi guys, this is my caricature. What's going on? Hi, how's everyone doing? Uh, hi, y'all out there. I figured I'd do this uh, video for you guys. This will probably be my last video. Well, what do you mean, the last video? I don't mean my last video, guys, like ever. I mean my last video for 2018. Because, as we all know, 2019 is just right over the horizon. And, well, hopefully it's going to be a bigger, better year for everyone. And I hope so, too, for everyone. And, and if I don't post a video before, whenever, afterwards, Happy New Year to everyone, you know, early. Hope you guys' 2018 was great. Hopefully 2019 will be much fucking better. So, yeah. And so, I'm going to take the time to kind of uh, reflect on my channel this year you know starting out I did a lot of ship videos which a lot of people liked me for that which by the way I'm sorry for the people that love my ship videos that I'm not done that much of that lately I'm planning on doing some more problem is I don't have a lot of stuff I don't have a lot more ship related stuff to show because I did a lot of videos like from the Commodore's collection and I showcased a lot of stuff I had and I've not gotten a lot of new stuff. Because I've been collecting other things too. I don't just collect ship memorabilia. I collect electric trains. I collect Thomas memorabilia. I collect, you know, action figures and comic books and, you know, shit like that. So I just don't buy just one general thing. I buy all kinds of shit. And that's for the people with the Lionel trains and stuff. You know, like a lot of people like my Lionel videos. I'm going to do some more Lionel videos. I'll do some more running videos. I've not really got much for the Lionels, so I've not gotten really nothing new for a while on that. So I'm still wanting to get some smoke pellets for my 2018, so there'll be a video of it smoking. That'll be fucking awesome to see. But, and I'm still planning on building a layout. I just don't know what scale layout I want to do now, because ever since um, I got, and I showed you guys my. Double O scale Hornby Thomas that I got for Christmas. It kind of got me thinking I could either do A, do my Lionel layout like I said I wanted to do, or B, do a double O slash HO scale layout and make it into like an Island of Sodor ish Thomas the Tank Engine themed layout where I can have both Bachnum and Hornby Thomas the Tank Engine and friends items, you know. And kind of build kind of my ideal form of the island of Sodor. That or build an awesome small Lionel train layout. I don't know. You guys can tell me in the comment section down below what you think I should do. And I'll listen to suggestions. The um, thing I'm really surprised about is we're almost at 400 subscribers. That's pretty crazy. And I've had this channel for a long time, and I was kind of hoping to be at much higher number than that, because my good friend KaneFan701, he's been on YouTube for 10 years, and he has over 10,000 some odd subscribers, and that sucks, because I, I kind of wish I had the big numbers too. I mean, I'm, I'm posting shit every other day. He doesn't post often, but I post about every other day. If I don't post one video, I post two or three videos in succession. So, I mean, 400 is still good, but I really want to bump that volume up. I want to get more people, more people exposed to what I'm doing. So, and I've met some good people this year, too. And I actually met someone I, I was really, it really touched me. Um... Sorry, I was checking my time. Um, I met this uh, young man. I met him on DeviantArt. Uh, uh, his name's Jacob. Uh, his uh, username on DeviantArt was uh, Jacob Western Eleven. His YouTube channel is Jacob Western RR Eleven. If you want to go check him out, you should. He's got a great channel. Anyway, he became a DeviantArt member because of me. Uh, ever since he was younger and he got into ships and stuff, he found out about the ship personifications and stuff. And he saw all mine and C 
seeing my stuff, it inspired him to draw his own personifications of ships, including the SS United States. And because I got to meet him, and I met him, and got to know him and stuff, and and he told me that I, that I I influenced him with what he does. It's it's very touching, you know. I I never would have thought that. I would have an, an, an impact on somebody, and it's something. And it's, he's not the first one either. Like my friend Kane Fan Seven or One, he said I, my my art and my stuff impacted what he does too, and several other people. And it just <sighs> sorry, it, it's very touching, and I I just want to say thank you guys so much it it really means a lot to me that people enjoy the crazy shit I'm doing because a lot of the stuff I'm doing is crazy shit and especially with some of the new videos I'm coming up with you know like I've got a new a new series called Thomas and Percy Reviews where our favorite talking engines Thomas the Tank Engine and Percy the Small Green Engine. They're reviewing things. They're reviewing movies. They're reviewing YouTube videos. They're reviewing classic episodes and episodes of Thomas the Tank Engine and Friends. Or Thomas and Friends if it's newer. They're talking. They're having discussions on things. They're doing all kinds of stuff. They had discussion on the Thomas Wooden Railway Controversy. Which if you haven't seen it you should watch it. It's very eye opening. And their, I, their remarks about the whole thing, it really puts it in perspective about that whole bit of shit that went on there. Um, and of course, you know, I did my modeling videos where I showed you guys my, my reviews, my inbox model reviews on models, and then like my update videos on models. Like, I'm still haven't finished the Lusitania model, but I'm hoping sometime in 2019. I'll get everything I need and I'll finish her up. I'll finish my uh, present in Cleveland model up. I will finish, um, you know, I've got several other models in the works. I'll get them all finished up. And I'm also would like to get some more stuff either for my Lion Nail collection, which I do want to do. I'll get some more stuff from my Hornby collection, which I just started. If you guys don't know, I got something I had as a child for Christmas, and it's this little guy right here. Say hi, Thomas. Yeah, I got this little guy for Christmas, and I've already taken him apart, and I've uh, serviced him, and he runs like a like a well-timed Swiss Swiss pocket watch. And it, not just that, this year, I've also have been I've also learned how to repair Lionel trains because of uh, Lionel for less. If you know him, he's a YouTuber. He teaches people how to repair toy trains. He was the one that told me about this book. I got this book, and I've learned to repair so many different trains. And I repaired a lot of trains. I repaired my own trains. I repaired trains for other people. And I've talked. I've had several discussions on Lionel trains, and I've had an unboxing video where I unboxed a train set brand new for my birthday. I'm undone a couple of other sets I had I did a review um, I, a while back I think it was last year I did it but I did a review an unboxing a review of the 1547 S freight set from 1956 which is my one of my prides of my collection but you know I'm trying to pump all this content out and stuff and a lot of people would think after all these years Commodore you still have ideas? Yes, I've still got a lot of crazy fucking ideas, just like DeviantArt. I've got a lot of crazy fucking ideas for DeviantArt, for drawings and shit. And my friend KaneFan701 once again gave me some ideas, like, hey, could you maybe do this and this and this? And uh, I'm thinking, yeah, sure, man, why not? It's a fucking great idea, so yeah, sure. And also on this channel, you know, I've done movie reviews. I've done movie review for the Grinch, the new Grinch. And I done a four-part review of this movie here, Incredibles 2. Fucking love this movie. Thomas and Percy reviewed this movie too, so you guys should watch that. It's really fucking awesome to hear those two guys talk about it. Uh, but it just, 
it's just a whole massive scope of everything I've done this year. And that's just this year, 2018, 2019. Who the fuck knows what will be coming that year. I definitely know for certain I'm planning on doing a couple of videos, like showcasing a couple of my home-built models. Not model kits, but home-built scratch models. Like custom-made, where I made from, took absolutely fucking nothing and turned it into something. So that's definitely coming. I'm definitely going to be doing that. And I'll be doing some more train running videos. I'll have, I'll do a, I've not done an actual review review on my Hornby Thomas set, but I'll have it up and running and we'll review it. And I'll give you my pros, my cons, and what I think about it and stuff. And it'll be a good video too. And there's definitely going to be more Thomas and Percy videos. I know you guys probably like them. I know you, Jacob, you like the Thomas and Percy videos. There's definitely going to be more of those coming. Um, and who knows in the future. I'm actually wanting to do a, um, a custom video where I'm wanting to buy a, a, a another Hornby engine. You know, a duplicate of Hornby engine. I want to make a custom. And uh, I want to surprise a, a certain friend of mine with a custom Hornby electric engine of a particular character he had created or helped to create in fruition. So, I don't know. I would like to do that, but I don't know if I can or not. Like I said, a lot of the shit I want to do costs money. And money something that's hard for me to get a hold of right about now. Sorry. So if I can get a hold of money and shit, there's definitely going to be a lot of unboxing videos. Definitely a lot of unboxing videos. Unboxing shit. And then I'll have review videos. I'll have, you know, I'll even have some discussion videos where I'll just talk about random shit. You know, I know a lot of people do that, and I might even have some random bullshittery videos where I just spew on about different things. You know, rant videos, whatever the fuck ever, I mean. But overall, 2018 wasn't that bad of a year. It wasn't that great of a year, but it wasn't that bad. And I'm hoping, let's, let's try to get the viewership, or um, the subscribership, from the 380 point section. Let's try to boost up to a thousand. Let's try to boost up to five thousand. Let's try to boost up to ten thousand. Let's try to boost it up fucking high. I know it ain't gonna be as high as T Series and PewDiePie and Vanoss Gaming and them, but let's get it up there, guys. I'm doing this shit for y'all. You know, so let's try to get the subscribership up there. Try to get, try to get all the, try to get the, uh, try to build up my crew. Try to build the crew of the uh, the Commodore ship bigger, so we can have a bigger ship to operate. <laughs> That's just the terminology, not really for real, but... So, yeah. So, I just want to thank you guys for a great year. Thank you very so much for, you know, a good year 2018. I'm going to make it a lot better 2019, and like I said before in the beginning of the video, Happy Early New Year to everyone. I hope everyone... I, you know, pleasant holidays, and I hope you guys' this year will be great. And if you ever want any good entertainment, you know where to come to. Come to me. And as always, you know, that's about it. So until next time, I will see you in the new year. This is your friend Common Urban saying, have smooth seas and clear skies. Happy sailing with you, and God bless. You take care now. Goodbye-bye.